Okay, disclaimer for this game. I did indeed watch it before, but I have never played it before. And the last time I watched it was a long time ago. I'm not even gonna lie. But I kind of remember a little bit about the ending. I don't really remember about the lore. So I am excited to try to get in and get, try to get every little detail I can and answer all the questions that I had. Welcome back. Hey, here, I'll just, there we go. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, yeah, oh, oh, my, my, oh, oh, blinking, don't blink, don't blink, you'll, you'll ruin it. On tonight's episode, two innocent children will face their most primal fears, haunted by mysteries from beyond the grave. Ho, ho, ho. Ancient secrets that should never have been unearthed, tormented souls wandering between realities. Turn off the lights and enjoy this chilling tale. Hee <laughs> another one welcome to another dimension welcome to midnight scenes gosh they make such good games they know how to set it up too what are we looking at blue ocean ah ah Little birdies in the Powerpuff house. What an interesting house shape. October 1986. Okay. Who are we gonna play as? Uh, what is this? Ah! Good morning. My name is John Wilson. Tina. This little oh, this is a little girl. Oh, good morning. Wait a second. I'm John Wilson. What are you talking about? You must be a double. <gasps> Doppelganger. A double? Are you crazy? Doubles don't exist. Really? Then how do you explain this? Oh no, you're a doppelganger, my evil double, aren't you? Are you here to kill me and steal my identity? I don't want to die so young. Ah. ah, here we go. Are you coming to say goodbye to mom and dad? I'm busy. Uh, what are you playing anyway? Uh, they're going to be away for three days. Won't you miss them? Going to be away for three days. Won't you miss them? Why should I? They leave me alone with you and that silly Veronica for three days. I hate them. Wow. A little strong. Veronica is nice. I like her. That's because you don't have any personality. This is a great sister. What are you playing anyway? <sighs> I still can't believe they bought me another identical Benny for my birthday. They don't care about me at all. They don't even remember which toys they already gave me. Yeesh. Mm, aren't two Bennies better than one? Yeah. Don't be silly. It's ridiculous. Can I have one of them? No way. I'd rather keep playing this stupid doppelganger thing for the rest of my life. Man, you are giving Icky Vicky vibes. You know that? Leave me alone. Oh, whatever. Better say goodbye to mom and dad before they leave. I want to take a look-see. I want to look at every... Oh. Okay. Alright. Sofa. Mm, the m and steam is still there. <laughs> Oh, look at that! My M&M stain! Yeah, totally not some dookie. Alright, nothing there. What's happening on the TV? Support your indie devs! I found the other one. Let's go. Um, screw you, Mom and Dad. I'm going upstairs. Dad's office? Dad won't let us go into his office if he's not home. Well, he's home right now. It's a perfect excuse. Tina's room. I better not go into Tina's room if I want to stay alive. <laughs> oh, pretty plant. Oh, poor thing. It's dying. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, the edges are a little... Ah, they got apps for that. They got apps to tell you. Miss Jenkins would send me home if I painted something like that. 
Ah, another abstract art hater. Let's go. Ooh, is this I have room. Walkie talkies. Let me get to try out my new walkie talkies. Okay, you don't want to take them? It's out the window. There's a new starling nest in the big tree. Oh, that's cute. Posters? The One Eyed Pea Island poster is my favorite. Looking forward to the premiere of Galaxy of Cats, part two. All right. I wanted to look at all the details. I'm satisfied. Can I look out this window? The Jordan's garden looks so empty since Thomas got sick. Aw. Will this window say anything different? I doubt, right? It's in the same little area. Yeah, it says the same thing. Okay, all right, let's go downstairs. Mommy, Daddy, you're leaving me with Vicky. Don't worry. If anything comes up, I'll call you right away. Have a great trip. The bay is beautiful this time of year. Wish we were going for pleasure, not work. We should go. The plane leaves in three hours, and we might hit some traffic. Ah, leaving early. Smart. Bye, kids. Be good. And don't push Veronica too hard. We won't. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Laters. She looks chill. She definitely got the 80s look. Well, here we are. Yep. We still have a couple hours until dinner time. What would you like to do? Ooh, let's paint. Let's paint. I like to paint trucks that explode and... Your drawings are boring. You paint like a little baby. Dude, Tina needs an attitude check and a belt whipping. That's not true. Uh, watch TV. Let's watch TV. The Amazing Jess Marks is about to start. I love that show. Of course you do. TV is entertainment for dumb kids. Just freaking, you're right behind her. Just kick her in the freaking back. Tina, don't talk to your brother like that. It's Christina. Only my family calls me Tina. I've taken care of you so many times. Don't you consider me family yet? Pfft, don't be ridiculous. Well, Oliver, looks like your sister is in a mood today. Yeah, maybe she wants to tell us what to do. Let's go into the forest. The forest? On the other side of the lake. Uh, should we? I think we should stay at home. We go there some afternoons with mom and dad. It's very pretty. The trees are painted in different colors. Let's, let's say this one, I guess, if it's true. Yeah, it's super cool. We go there some afternoons with mom and dad. We cross the lake with the boat and have a picnic sometimes. Can we go, please? That way I can look for my toy truck. I lost it in the clearing the other day. Okay, fine. Just for an hour and then we come back. Yay! You pick up the oars. Sure. Oh, but they're outside now. So what if I go upstairs? Can I check the rooms now? Like her rooms? What if I go to dad's office now? Okay, what if I go to her room now? No. <sighs> Fine. Where are the oars? Outside? Should be easy. Why didn't she get them? <laughs> I love my little stubby legs. Oh. So cute to be short. You passed them! You could have just took them on your way. Alright, I guess I'm doing everything. Yoink. Ooh, got rope too. Got him! Tree branch. The Jordan's trees are invading our garden! Yeah, cut it off. Hole. Sparkle has to come in tea in days. Aww. Who's Sparkle? Do you guys have a dog? Is there anything over here? No. To the pier. Dang! We have a pier? We're rich, rich. Do either of you know how to row? I've never piloted a boat. Leave it to the professionals. But it's safe, right? If you don't know how to do this and you're the one that's chaperoning, you should not be doing this. Don't be afraid. There are no monsters in the lake or anything like that. Just sit next to me and take my hand. Oh. Ugh. Get in the boat, lovebirds. Take my hand, Veronica. We will look into the sun while we... Huddle up. We need to install the oars first. Okay, I mean. All aboard! 
There we go. What? I didn't get a little love scene? This is ridiculous. How else am I supposed to get Veronica to fall for me? Can I look for my truck? It can't be very far. Can I go see the tree paintings? Tree paintings? What are- Can I go see the tree paintings? Did I tell you they're like a billion years old? Really? Wow! I'll look for my truck too. Can't be far. Okay, you can go, but don't walk too far away. I don't want to lose sight of you. Just come with us. What do you want now? Alright, you're... You're right, Oliver. This forest is beautiful. Oh, <laughs> just like you, Veronica. Alright, bye! This is pretty. Gosh, I love pixel art games. They're so pretty. Alright, to the forest. I mean... Oh! <gasps> A chocolate bar! Oh, hello. Oh, there's a drawing there. Okay. Two crows. Three crows. People are so inconsiderate. Pick it up. Clean it up after them. Don't leave it there. Hello! Oh! Ho ho! Ho ho! What's this drawing? Okay. People are holding hands. Kumbaya. What is this? Vases? This looks like a pattern. Hello. 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 <laughs> I love that you can tap on them. What's this? Oh. Huh. They say if you count the rings, you can read their age. Alright, so this one's one, two, three, four years old. What a little boy. Just like me, I'm tiny too. Oh, weird. This looks like a cat. This is a cat skull? Is that sparkles? What's this one? Oh, I can't look. Oh. Hello. 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 Good morning. I can't look at those tree paintings either. <gasps> Ew. Ew. Squirmy wormy. Oh, squirrely. Uh, what she, what you snacking on? <laughs> what? What you eating? Uh, yummy? Is that, is, that, is that tasty? Is that a tasty finger? Mm, enjoy. What? <laughs> Are we just not gonna react to that? Oh no, turn around. No, we ain't even messing with that. Oh no. Mm -mm. Oh, what is this? No! No, leave that alone. Don't touch it. Pretend it doesn't even exist. Mom never lets me play this far from the clearing. My truck must be around here somewhere. Why would your truck be here if Mom never allows you over here? Explain that. S explain, explain how that works. Bink. Bink. Man, these crows are talkative today. Yay, my truck! Wait, let's go past it. Nope. Can't. Okay. I tried. My truck! Here you are. Who put you there? I don't know. It was very perfectly. What? Hey, Oliver, come here. There's something I want to show you. Tina? What are you doing here? No! Turn around! That's not Tina. Why would Tina be all the way? Yep, that's not Tina. Alright. Confirm. Thank you. Something squirrels in the forest. It's almost as if they live here. One time they ate a kid from town. Uh, head to. Okay. Only his bones remained. I'm not lying. It was on the news. Oh, maybe that was the kid. That's creepy. By the way, where's your brother? I told him not to walk too far away. Don't ask me. I'm not the babysitter. <sighs> Oliver! Are we Veronica now? Uh, we're kind of leaving Tina behind. <laughs> I mean... Oh. Ooh. Oliver! What's wrong? What the frick is that? The forest is full of paintings like that. 
Like this? That says there's this magical aura from the tribes that lived in the woods. It keeps paintings bright. This one, though. I haven't seen it before. It certainly looks recent. So creepy. You didn't paint it to scare pa to scare passerby, did you? How did I paint it? It's like 20 feet tall. Oh, it's weird. The Oliver? Come on, it's time we go back home. I don't like this place. It gives me the creeps. Come, Oliver, let's go. Oliver? <gasps> oh, Oliver! What? What's happening? Is he alright? No idea. Come on, help me get into the boat. Oh, he was like entranced. Hey! You came too! Thank God you're back. How are you feeling? What happened? A blood sugar drop, probably. Here, eat this chocolate. I found it in the woods. It's good! Hazelnut's my favorite. Really? Mine too! Oh, you can have my hazelnuts. Hey, are you sure you're okay? Maybe I should call the doctor? How long was I unconscious? You've been out for about 10 minutes. Huh. You scared us to death. And Tina? Where is she? In her room, I think. I wonder what she wanted to show me. What do you mean? In the woods. She told me to follow her. Oh yeah, I tried, but she walked too fast. Then I found that strange drawing on the rock. It really impressed you, huh? I don't know, I guess. Come on, rest while I heat up dinner. The lasagna I brought will surely bring you back to life. Ooh, I'm not a big fan of lasagna. Oh, time's passing. An entire hour went by. Looks like dinner did wonders. I like that happy rosy face. Oh, do you? Now rest, little prince. Have sweet dreams. Don't listen to her. What? Tina. She's always mean. But I think you're cool. Oh, thank you very much. I think you're cool too. Oh, did you like holding my hand on the boat? I really enjoy taking care of you both. You know? You're very, you're very interesting kids. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Hey, do you want me to show you my collection of cards? It's from the Midnight Zombies TV series. Sure, I love that. Sweet. Oh. Scared zombie. This one's the biggest and scariest zombie of the family, but it's always nice to the living. Aw. Can I check the back of the card? No, I can't. Baby zombie. Don't be fooled. Even though it's a baby, this one has a super, super sharp teeth. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. And this one's the most evil. She devours brains. Kind of looks like Tina. Oh, look at that doggy! And this one's my favorite. Isn't she cute? Aww. What a fantastic collection. I love it. Hope you don't dream of brain-eating zombies tonight. Get some rest, Oliver. Aww. Good night. Night. Veronica, please. I love you. We'll marry you one day, Veronica. Oh. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey! Hey! Oliver! What is that on the face? Is that like a hand? Oliver! Hey, Oliver, are you awake? Uh, what do you want? Let me sleep. Tina, what's wrong? It's Veronica. She's gone. She left us. She's downstairs. I hear the TV. Stop. You're always trying to scare me. Yeah, I hear the TV. Oh, yeah? Why don't you go down and check it out? I'm telling you. I saw her from my window. She was walking towards the pier. She must be meeting her boyfriend secretly when she should be here taking care of us like that other time. Okay, I believe you. You made that up. I believe you. She shouldn't be with the boys when she's taking care of us. Exactly what I think. 
But this time, I have my camera. I'll take pictures. Ooh. Come on, let's see if we can spy on them from the window. Are they there? You don't have to open the window. See something? The boat's missing. They've gone to the other side of the lake. How romantic. How? She doesn't know how to steer the boat. More proof that she's with her boyfriend. Uh, doubt? I can see a light in the forest, but nothing more. Dad has the old binoculars in his office. I'm not going to Daddy's office at night. Uh, you want me to get them? Of course. I have to keep watch in case they come back. Come on, they must be on his desk or in a drawer. Or maybe in the closet. <sighs> Alright, whatever. I'm going to try out these new walkie-talkies. Can't pick those up yet? Once we look out the window. What a starry sky! Can we go into Tina's room? Oh. Ah. Uh, come on, it's cracked open and everything. Daddy's room. Daddy! Dad would be mad if he found out I've been snooping around in his office. Why would he get so butthurt? Trophies. Ah. Uh. Oh, he was a little star player, huh? Sure. Whoa, he was in the military? I wonder if Dad killed someone in the war. Maybe I'll ask him when he comes back. Okay. Key. Why would I need a key? Oh, don't answer it. Leave. Why don't you leave? Oh, it's still ringing. Freak you! What? Hello? Hang up! Hang up! Hang up! Hang up! Hang it up! Hang it up! Who, who is it? Stop! You're letting the spirit in! Hang it up! Veronica, please come back. Why did you leave us? Oh, I wonder if... Maybe I shouldn't have answered it. Key. Key. It's locked. Key. Ah! What? Uh, what was that? You <laughs> would say... What's this, a little, little condom? These are from when I was born. There's a freak. I like Veronica, but I miss, but Miss Marquez was super, was a super cool nanny. She had this eye patch, like black beard. I miss her. She would have never left a. Okay. So this is bringing back memories of what I thought was happening in this game. I think that there was a kiss mark here and- oh no, okay, so there was a kiss mark there and there's condoms. There was a kiss mark on that photo with the nanny on it. I think he was having an affair with the nanny and especially I think that uh, this kid that we are right now, what's her name? Tommy? Timmy? Whatever. I think he is the child of the nanny. That is my theory. That crow is staring at me. Because it seems like this spirit is very infatuated with us, if that's the right word. Very focused on us rather than, like, Tina. We don't look exactly matching like Tina. I didn't see the mom. Oh, I wish I paid attention to the mom. But I do think we're the nanny's biological kid. And that he had an affair and something went down where he took, like, he murdered the nanny. I think that's my- Oh. Oh. Finally, give me the binoculars. No way, I got them. It's my turn to look. But that's my guess. Oh, no, I don't like that. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. No, this is not okay. Can we not? Can we? Can we? I'm not ready. You yeah, keep looking. Uh, uh, I'm scared. Stop. It's too... St There's nothing here. Crow, crow, crow. There's nothing! I don't see anything! Why do you do this to me? There's nothing here. What is these? Stop! It's gonna jump scare me! There's nothing. <laughs> Where am I? Oh, there she is. Oh gosh, her mouth is open. I see Veronica. 
Is she possessed? She's alone and looks confused. Hey, wait! She stole my flashlight! That thief! Come on, let's go to the pier. Maybe we can see what's going on from there. Okay, I'm not staying alone. We can't leave the house at night. Mom and Dad will find out. Yep. We can't leave the house at night. Mom and Dad will find out. Okay, I'll go alone. But I'd lock myself in the bedroom if I was you. I will. You know, the goblin in the attic likes to hunt at night. And I won't be here to protect you. Shut up. So are you coming? Yes. <laughs> Great, get dressed. I'll grab your walkie-talkies. We might need them in case we lose track of each other. But we're not going to, are we? Of course not. It's just a precaution. Ah, uh, okay. I'll get the walkie-talkies. Okay, I changed my mind. I, I, like, I'm, I'm having... As reading these texts, I'm realizing that, like, if she was pregnant and this was her kid and she was the nanny, it would have to be very obvious. So, definitely, I'm not her kid. But maybe she, like, really got attached to me. I'm going to put on something warm. I'm, like, trying to, like, think about it. Like, maybe she got super attached. Because why is she only talking to us and not to Tina? Because it seems like we liked her. But maybe Tina didn't like her as much. I have the walkie-talkies. Great, let's go to the pier. Anything on the TV? Good to know. Great. <laughs> that was great. That was that was good. That was good. That's cool that it changed. That's actually really cool that it changed up. Sucks that we couldn't go into her room. Alright. Can I get this stick? Join streams and be in your garden. Hello. Sparkle hasn't come in days. Oh, Sparkle. Yeah, there, there, there's definitely an affair that happened, though. What is that? Is that a backpack? Possible to see anything from here. They've taken the boat to the other shore. We'll have to walk around the lake on foot. A very bad feeling about this. What? Go through the woods at night? I have a bad feeling. Do you think I'm enjoying this? Of course you are. I don't like it when you get bossy like this. Why does everything have to be done your way? Well, I don't like dragging along a whining, crying baby either. Oh, that's so mean. So we both have to put up with it. Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, you're being a douche. Sometimes you're not such a crybaby. Thank you. Huh? What now? There's something floating in the water. Yeah, that's what I was looking at. Looks like a bag. It's Veronica's bag. Are Are you sure? Yes, see? It has a Piero with the cat's face on it. It's hers. Did she drop it? Don't. We'll never reach it from here. Find something long to get it with. Ah, pr pruner? What am I going to do with a pruner? Uh, Tina? Did you find something? Pruner. Pruner. A rope. Alright, it didn't work. The stick? Hello. Keeping an eye on me? What are you doing? Don't trees are being a garden. Pruner on the tree? I don't think that's how it. Mm, mm, ah, with a kid with our strength? I doubt that's how it works. Oh, with the lights flashing. That's really weird. Wait, why is it calm in here now? Nope, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was. I don't know why. I was like, hmm, this is a little weird. Alright, alright, alright. Weird. Trying to see, is there anything going on? I don't think so. Okay. To the pier I go. Here you go, I got you a stick. Sticky, sticky for you, Tina. Oh, 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 don't. Ah, no. Tina! Are you okay? It's very cold. Something's wrapped around my leg. I can't get out. Tina, what do I do? Hey, calm down. Everything will be fine. Come on now. Throw me something to hold on to. I better get... 
tie the rope somewhere. Tie it to the bollard. Bollard. Rope. There you go. Now go find help. You're gonna die of hypothermia. Mrs. Jordan is awake. I saw a light in her window. Come on. I'll be fine. Don't worry. Just hurry up, okay? Here, take one of the walkie-talkies. That way I know you're, you're okay. Uh, throw it in the water. Alright. <laughs> Thank you. Is that, is that how it works? Find help. Mrs. Jordan's house. Quick. Can we go in Tina? Okay, I know this sounds awful now. But is there a chance we can go in Tina's room now? That she's like all locked. She's like locked away. Like I actually want to see if there's any way we can sneak into her room. Oh gosh, that's really creepy. Dang it! <laughs> Come on, she's drowning. It's time to go Snoopy. Oh, what's up with this painting? Big painting. We never looked at it. Modern art. Yuck. Oh, I love them. Oh. What are these keys for? It's locked. Oh, is this how we get to the... Oh, it's how we get out. Oh, I didn't realize that. I was just trying to be Snoopy. Oh. I better call Tina. I hope she's okay. What are you eating back there? Are you guys enjoying some tomato soup? What is that? Tina, are you still there? I don't know what to, to do without you, sis. No, don't say that. Tina, are you still there? Yes, I'm freezing, though. Have you found help? I'm on it. Hey, you guys enjoy tomato soup, huh? Tomato basil? Strawberry soup? I hope that's not sparkle. Oh. <laughs> no, it's, it's not. It's not. It's Veronica. It's Veronica. You're fine. Oh wow, oh wow, I like this house much, much, much more than our house. No offense. Ring-a-ding! Ding-dong! Help me? My sister's dying? Oliver! Hi! What are you doing here? Is everything alright? Mrs. Jordan, I need help. Our babysitter was staying with us, but she left us and we're looking for her and... Okay, okay, breathe. Come on in. It's cold outside. Hi! I'm gonna snoop around your house now. Okay, slow down. What happened? It says, Amanda, Tina fell into the lake off the pier. Tina fell into the lake off the pier? Oh my gosh! Is she okay? Yes, but she can't get out of the water. She needs help. And where are your parents? They're out. They left us with the babysitter, but she had abandoned us. Okay, I'll run to the pier to help. <gasps> Hey, <laughs> Miss Jordan? Your sister? You stay here and attend Thomas in case he needs anything. You know he requires special attention. He's in his room. Keep an eye on him, will you? I'll be right back. She changed, like, her demeanor. No? No, oh, Mrs. Jordan comes back with Tina soon. Alright, time to look around. Bottle. Bottle. Peach juice! Yummy! Can I have some? Glug glug? I love the lip mark stain. Thomas's room. I can't go up there. I could go. Wait, hold on. Can I actually? Sorry, I'm snooping. Thomas's room is downstairs. Oh. Worth a shot. A bar in the main room. That is brave. Hello, Thomas? Oh, hi, Thomas. Oliver, what are you doing here? Tina's in trouble. Your mom went to help her. Really? I thought your mom was taking a. I thought mom was taking a bath upstairs. Oh, sorry. Sometimes my medication makes me confused. Is Tina okay? Yes, but she always ends up in trouble. She fell into the lake and can't get out. Seriously? Well, don't worry. Mom is very strong. She'll pull her out of the water. Wait, so... Wait, wait, wait. If Mom's upstairs, then who was the one that... Is that the ghost? Is that what it is? But there was a lip mark stain. Or is the lip mark stain attached to the lip mark kiss? Oh, I don't know. Come on, she'll be fine. 
I swear though, I thought mom was chilling in the bathroom. See, he's real. Oh, I hate this medication. How do you feel? Physically or mentally? Uh, mentally. Mentally. Well, it's only been two months since dad died. Oh. It's been hard, and mom makes me go to therapy with a super boring lady. And how are you feeling physically? I can't take two steps without gasping for air. Other than that, I feel wonderful. Maybe a wheelchair could help you. Can I ask you something that I never asked you before? You don't have to answer if you don't want to. Of course, ask away. You never told me about how your father died. About your illness. Uh, I don't... Uh, out of these questions are very... Uh, father! I don't know. Mom never talks about it. One day, he got a call from the doctor and suddenly he stopped talking to us. He spent the rest of his days crying and sleeping. I'm sorry. I'm sure he loved you very much. I don't know. He changed a lot. Oh, we, we asked both. Okay, so it's not even an option. Alright. About your illness. Are you going to die soon? I'd be very lonely. You're my best friend at school. Yeah, no idea. Mom always makes plans for the future. But I think she does it just to cheer me up. Her words are happy, but her face is sad. But I don't care too much about it. I'm not afraid of dying. Really? I'll go back to the same dark, tranquil place where I was before I was born. Doubt. But, you know, you do you. I like that idea. It's an idea, alright. Anyway, let's stop talking about sad things. Look, I want to show you something. Super cool. What is it? Ah, no, this isn't cool. Alright. <laughs> Found it in Mom's closet. I think she uses it to talk to Dad. Come on. Who do you want to contact? There are a lot of people I want to talk to. Uh, I don't want to contact anyone. I don't want to contact anyone, no. No. These things. I don't like them. Come on, there must be someone you miss. Your grandparents? They're still alive. Really? How boring. <laughs> Come on, give me a name. Okay, I want to contact my dog, Alia, Elvis, Miss Marquez. Miss Marquez, my old nanny. She lived in this house before you. Oh. She lived in this house before we moved in? Oh, that's weird. So during the affair, she was also a neighbor? She was great. She had one eye missing, wore an eye patch like a pirate. One day she suddenly disappeared. Mom told us she went to live on her family's farm in Colorado. Oh, yeah. Took her out to the farm, all right. But Tina said she saw an ambulance in the police. I think something horrible happened to her. Ooh, what if, like, Mom found out and, like, raged out? Mothers lie, you know. They do it to protect us, but they lie. We're going to contact your old babysitter. If she died in this house, her presence will be super strong. It'll be super cool, you'll see. I don't know. Come on, this is fun. Here, put your hand on this triangle thing. It's called a planchette. I don't want to. Leave! No! Okay. Now I'll add my hand. That way we join our energies. Now, close your eyes. Okay. Do you have them closed? Yep, I do. Good. Now focus on your old babysitter's image. I found this picture of her in my father's office. Do you think it might help? Are you kidding? It would help a lot. Let me see. Yep, there's the kiss mark. Here's the baby. Super cool. She really looks like a pirate. She's really pretty, too. Alright. Oh, and the front. Tina was happy with her. This picture will attract her spirit. Come on, put it next to the board. Let's start. I don't know if I like this. Relax, we can stop it whenever we want. We simply say goodbye to the spirit, and she'll leave without a trace. Ready? Oh. Oh. I'm... What is this? I'm... 
My eyes are... Wait, if their eyes are closed, how do they know what letters are tit... How does that make sense? If their eyes are closed, how do they know which letters... Or maybe... Maybe only Oliver's eyes are closed. Alright, I'll keep mine closed. You're moving it. It's not me, it's your nanny spirit. I'm... Not... So, uh, do you have a leak? Uh oh. Hehehe, <laughs> why is it white when it's landing red? The bathroom is right above us. Maybe mom left the tap running? Don't get up. I'm going to take a look. Wait right here. Ah, oh, now I can look around your room. This is Midnight Zombies poster is the best. Oh wow, you got a big old poster. Big, big, big poster. How's that bottle looking? There's the mark. Mm. <laughs> Window. Your house looks beautiful from here. Your house looks disgusting. It literally looks like someone from Lego Minecraft made it. Our house looks beautiful. Okay. You're just gonna keep blabbing about your house? Fine. <laughs> no! Oh no! The horror! Oh my gosh! Mrs. Jordan! But how? If I don't get it, I don't get it! If this is Mrs. Jordan, who's with Tina? This is odd. Tina? Tina, are you there? That's Mrs. Jordan! That Mrs. Jordan's not real! The real Mrs. Jordan! Mrs. Jordan's dead! There's blood everywhere! Tina, do you hear me? Nah, Tina got got. I have to go to the pier quickly! Now, let's take a browse! Can we throw out the water? Frickin' for the house's sake? Oliver, what is it? I heard you screaming! It was the bathtub. Stay here, don't go upstairs, okay? I don't think you can even go upstairs. It was the bathtub. That's up scary. Had big had a lot of soup. Listen to me. I have to go find Tina. You stay here and call the police. Do what I tell you. The the police? Because of an open tap? Just do it and tell them to come fast. Oliver. Man, this kid lost both. What's the police's phone number? <laughs> 911 911. Oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. They dragged the soup away. Ooh, and I'm stepping in it. Ooh. Bing, 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 bing. Can I go in Tina's room now? I don't want to go upstairs to even check anymore, but I'm gonna try! No time to lose. I have to go to the pier. Alright, well. That was an attempt. I tried, I tried. Dang. Could I go in Tina's room? Light's still flashing. Crows are here still. Nothing about sparkles, sparky. Let's have my trunk. Oh, she's gone, and the rope's gone. And the bag is gone. Oh no, she's gone. <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> so goofy. Barefoot. This is Tina, for sure. Who's barefoot? Oh, that's weird. Who would be barefoot? Their footprints lead to the path that borders the lake. Has Mrs. Jordan double taken Tina into the woods? But why? I have to go find her. Oh, is that Mrs. Jordan's feet? Those are some pretty good feet prints. You could sell those online. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh. Tina? Veronica? What is with this squirrel? My flashlight! Oh, it's rabid! Easy, easy! If I get closer, it'll bite me. Oh my gosh, it's rabid! Have my truck! Here, have fun! Chew on this! Why would I care about that? 
<laughs> flashlight truck, flashlight truck, flashlight truck. I'll chew on the truck. So weird. Evil little thing. Oh, wow. That did wonders. <laughs> yeah. I can't even look at the drawings anymore. The crows are gone, too. Nothing there. Tina! Tina, thank goodness I found you. Are you okay? Miss Jordan has a double. She murdered the real Mrs. Jordan and came for you. This is horrible. Come with me, Oliver. Ugh, where are you going? Tina? Oh, no. Oh, no. We're gonna die here. Hey, Crows. How you doing? Hi, everybody. How's everyone doing tonight? Huh? Welcome to the show. Welcome to the game. Ooh. Who is that? Tina? Where are you? Is Veronica already dead? Oh, is Veronica... Did Veronica get got? Ooh. What? Oh, she got got! Why? Veronica! Oh my gosh! What's happening? Uh-oh. <laughs> yep, that's the that's nanny. So the nanny's in on it somehow. Oh, I don't get it! My little Oliver, it's time for bed. May I sing you a lullaby? Who's this? Oh... Aww. Hey, how come the cops get into the room but not me? This is unfair. Don't worry. We'll find them. Even if we have to turn the whole world upside down. I've never seen anything like it. The two children kidnapped. The neighbor brutally murdered in her bathtub. The babysitter missing. What the heck happened here tonight? Detective, we found Veronica Turner, the babysitter, in the woods. She's dead. Gasp! Uh, also murdered? Uh, any clues on the kids? Well, actually, there's something else, but you better see it with your own eyes. Oh. Sorry, parents, we'll leave you be. Dad looks pissed. Oh no, he's like this. I thought he was like, Ugh. angry. How dare they get lost? Hey man, nice kyphosis. Oh no, <laughs> he's got the goofy face too! <laughs> oh, I see it. Oh gosh, poor girl. Look at her wounds. It looks like a wild animal attack. Wild animal doesn't murder people in their bathtubs or kidnap children though. I mean, we heard about the squirrel who ate a child. If you think that's strange, you haven't seen it all yet. Take a look at the rock. What am I supposed to see here? Darkness. Agent, point the light at the painting. What the hell? Ah, there they are! How? Why aren't we just trapped in a rock? Spirits in the woods. Oh, that's such a good ending. It's such a good cliffhanger, too. There is a second game to this. I think I will play that next week. Poor Oliver. Poor Tina. We might never know what happened to them. Lies! Second game's already out. But don't fret. Something tells me Detective Taylor won't rest until she finds an answer. For now, it's a secret between the two siblings. And the creature of the forest, the nanny. Thank you very much for enjoying this new chapter of Midnight Scenes with us. Remember to shut your windows and lock your doors tight before bed. Creatures of the night are lurking. Good night and sweet dreams. Ah, oh, that one's good. I still think a safe place is my favorite one. Yep. The nanny. So she got murdered or something. 
and she was just super attached to these kids along with the husband. Wife found out maybe and wife killed her. And so out of spite she came back and took her kids. Her kids. Maybe. But that's uh, such a good game. But yeah, Safe Place I think is my favorite. That one had a crazy story. And that one just came out. I'm like ready for like some like new ones to pop out. Oh, that was so good. Hey, yay for that game. I love it.